In this video, I'm going to talk to you about some of my tips for learning how to use the Caracorder. Tip number one, be realistic with yourself. Okay, I know we've all seen the TikTok videos, the viral YouTube shorts of Riley typing over 9,000 words per minute. That's not realistic for you to achieve in the first week, the first month, without a lot of practice. So just be realistic with yourself. Set good expectations. Don't set yourself up for failure. Tip number two, don't try to cord too soon. I know you want to get fast, and cording is the way to do that. However, if you try to do that before you have a good foundation on character entry, I think it's going to hurt you more than it's going to help you. When I was first learning back in the November and December, that when I first got my character, I tried to cord fast because I really wanted to get fast. And by doing so, it, I feel it really set me back because I was discouraged because cording was difficult. Cording is really challenging if you don't have a good foundation on character entry. So don't try to cord too soon. Tip number three, try to practice at least 15 minutes and maybe up to about an hour and a half, two hours a day. Don't do it all at once. Have shorter, smaller bursts of practice throughout the day, maybe 10, 15 minutes at a time spread throughout, and at least try to get one in before bedtime. That's gonna help build the muscle memory and learn. I feel like if you go in full immersion, which some people have done, I don't think you're gonna have as much expected return that you would think by putting in all that practice. I think there's diminishing returns and we've seen that consistently in the community. So just practice short bursts throughout the day. Don't try to do it all at once. Tip number four, when you're practicing, use launch pad, use monkey type, use key BR, use nitro type, use Z type, use all typing games. There's so many opportunities for you to use different typing websites to learn that that's going to keep you interested you won't lose motivation and switching it up switching up your routine can really help you break through some plateaus that you might get to number five join the discord community so there's lots and lots of people just like you who are trying to learn the character and how to use it in their day lives if you join the discord there's several channels that will be interesting where you can see how others are making progress, what they're doing, what kind of practice tips they have, what questions they have, learn how to use specific functions of the character. And on that note, you also want to read the wiki. So the wiki has been written by the community and it has a ton of knowledge. And if you read through that, it'll answer a lot of your common questions, give you tips about practicing, how to use the device, etc. So definitely make sure you read the wiki. And number six, final tip, have fun, okay? The Caracorder, it's, it's, it's a really cool device. It's very different. If you're not having fun while you're using it, you're gonna get demotivated, and we don't want that to happen. So have fun with it. Make sure you get good amount of sleep and rest, and just take breaks, and don't try to overdo it. I can't stress that enough. If you try to go too hard and just get really fast, really fast, you're gonna have a bad time. So just be realistic and you should be good. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed those tips. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or if there's any other videos you'd like to, to see me do. Thanks.